Today, I'm building a new office and starting to exploit the gaming industry. So if you're excited for that, remember to leave a like and let's get started. As we come into the morning, Logic Labs is doing pretty well. Let's take a look at what we are doing. Our 2D team is developing Logic 2D version 11 and it's due to come out in July 2018. In terms of the OS team, we are looking at a next release of July 2020. Our 3D team is designing the next gen and that is due to be released March 2022. Well, 2022, that's a long, long time. And of course, our audio team is doing pretty well. December 2019 is the next audio system. So, geez, that is a long time. If you guys got any thoughts and comments on development time for a lot of these projects, because honestly, they're so long, right? If you guys got any thoughts, suggestions, make sure you guys leave it in the comments down below. Today is an easy easy day here at Logic Labs because once you have automation doing all the work for you guys, there is honestly not much else to do in software -ing. Wrong! Always something to do here in software -ing. How can you improve your team's efficiency, all of that? And well, today, I want to exploit the next industry. Well, how do I say that in the right terms? I don't want to just create software for fun like we are doing with our 2D, OS 3D and audio, right? I want to exploit an industry and if we come into develop software we go down into games i want to exploit the gaming industry but let's just take a look at all software first check this out 68 million dollars in profit 20 million 242 million dollars but you come down even further you look at this one 356 million and it's done 105 million for like expansion packs let's build our own office shall we so i'm gonna start to small time lapse on this block of land wish me luck can we build the best office we're about to find out and see The game studio is complete. Let's take a look. Let's start off at the bottom floor. You enter through these doors. Well, there's no reception desk, but security stations. Oh, that's scary. <laughs> no, but that's all okay. On the bottom floor, we've got a bit of a, you know, sit down and chill area with coffee machines and mini fridges. On the other side, we've got a canteen, bathrooms in the middle, lifts and all that in the middle here, as well as a meeting room here. We've got one meeting room because I think we're only going to need one meeting room. Going up a stair, we've got a development studio here, development studio here, and development studio here. And as you'll see, throughout the whole office yet we got atriums right around the office and inside you're gonna have these balconies which is really cool it is something that we wanted to do in our one of our last series but we were unable to make it happen and well doesn't this just look 
awesome. Leave your thoughts and comments down below what you think of this new office. If we're going to exploit the gaming industry, the teams aren't going to magically appear themselves. So let's create some new teams, shall we? First team is just going to be D and then pretty much game. Games? Let's just do D games. It's a rainy April morning, but everyone is hired and we should be seeing the first of the teams coming into the office shortly. There they are. They're all starting to appear at work now. Beautiful to see. Let's create a game, shall we? It's going to be a game, duh, and it's probably going to be a simulation. Why? Because I think I want to do soft ink. Mm, there you go. It's going to be called softy ink. Just after Software Ring, but we're going to make the better version of Software Ring, and it's going to be a version that's going to make millions, and a version that's going to exploit, or it's going to be the start of our exploitation in Software Ring, and exploiting the gaming industry. So, what are we going to put on it? I think we're going to put on all of our single level. So, that's going to give us about an 83 expected interest. We're going to put that on the SCM. We're not going to do a framework just yet. Alright. 2D editor is going to be the best 2D editor out there, which is, of course, our version. And, of course, the best audio tool out there is definitely not our version yet, but we'll slowly get there. All the best operating systems. Let's go auto balance. We'll get about 94% expected interest. And we'll just make sure that it's not on any team. It's on DNN. Let's start developing. All right, we've got some of the best teams in here. The best teams in the house, I should say. Now, they're going to start developing the first software, which is good. So it's time to release our first simulation game called Softy Inc. Ready, set, Release, how did we go for the first game? Two, four, and two. Absolutely awesome. I'm not going to do a marketing budget. We're just going to do whatever we can. We'll go a million copies and we'll, do, we'll print about 100,000 a month. And in its first month, it makes half a million dollars. Absolutely awesome. And look at all of our other software. They're making millions of dollars. I'm currently developing an RPG game called StarCraft. And now what we are also going to do is we're going to come back to Softy Inc. We're going to, if I can find the button, make SQL. So this is going to be version 2. We're going to make sure there's a framework on here called Softy Inc. So it's going to have everything on here. The only difference is it's probably going to have some physics. And you know what? And maybe some mod support. Pretty much StarCraft is in the programming stage. So that programming stage is going to get done. Once the programming stage is done, that's going to be released. By the time we release StarCraft, Softy Inc. will also be going into development. So pretty much all of our teams have got something to do every single day and of every single night. In terms of the company, the company is also doing pretty well. What are we worth? $782 million. Wow, that's crazy. And StarCraft is ready to be released now. How did we go? Ooh, two, two, and three. All right, no marketing by Budget. I'm gonna just order a hundred thousand copies, but we've already got some game printed at the moment Let's see what that does. But first things first We need to make sure there's an update going on and Starcraft makes 1.4 million dollars in its first month Oh my that's actually quite cool and look at that softy ink at 11.2 million So Starcraft has made a gross 23 million and this one's made a total of 100 million. So that's about 130 million in total it's done. Like before all of our expenses and all of that jazz. Wow, that's absolutely crazy. And the company bank balance is at 1.3 million dollars. We're making lots and lots of money. What is next in Software Inc? Well, I don't know. Probably build something here on it. Probably do maybe like a nice massive mass, like a massive gigafactory just to generate electricity just like money making you know exploiting renewable energy in software wrinkles i don't know that's that actually sounds pretty good actually i'm thinking we could create another team and start looking at consoles or phone operating systems i think that'd be a really cool idea so guys make sure you leave a thought your thoughts and comments
comments down below. Let me know what you think. I'd like to know what you what you think, honestly. I think that'd be appreciated. Otherwise, guys, I think that's going to be all for today's video. Today, guys, if you did get enjoyed today's video, guys, consider subscribing down below. And, guys, I'll see you all in a new video soon.